peace of the God, man. Born King, Mathematics of Law, at your service. In the name of the Lord, peace. Peace, God. I appreciate you um, adding on with me. I'm all the way out from now why up here in True Cypher. Indeed. And you know, you, you uh, invited me and gave me a beautiful welcome. Indeed. So I want to know a little bit about your history. You know, we're going to build with all these other gods. And add <laughs> on, and you have been very pivotal in their, their growth and development. Right. Many of them. Um, let's talk about, let's start with how you got knowledge to yourself. Okay. Um, well, the knowledge of myself starts in the year of 91 born knowledge um that's when I first heard about the black man being God um definitely influenced through hip hop music um you know like my brother DJ Akeem um you know through the greats Big Daddy Kane Rakim you know my my my, my man was Rakim you know, when I was. When Rockham had an impact on me, Eric B. and Rockham. Mm-hmm. I um, got that album off one of my little culture seed homies at, hmm. at school that used to always, you always have those, I guess you call them wiggers, whatever, you know, mm-hmm. their parents buy them all, whatever everything, they whatever they want. So mm-hmm. I made him one of my good homies and I made sure like anything drop or anything new. They was getting it from now why hot off the press, you know, I'd mm. scoop that up off him and study it. You know, Tell me, so. were you you were born here in True Cypher? No, I was born in Jamaica. You was born in Jamaica? Yeah, Kingston, oh. Jamaica, halfway tree. Mm. So I'm a Yachty, you know. Mm, big up all the Yard gods. But big up big up all, all, the, all the ones who came from From the from, islands, from the you know. Peace to those, you know, those brothers and all, sisters. No separation at all, just you know. Right. Trying to make that distinction. Of, yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, so yeah, so you uh, you come, you come from from from, from Kingston, yeah. Jamaica. When did you come up here? I came. I came. Um, I think I was like around the guard, a lot of guard age around there. Um, my my, my family moved to the Bronx. I was in Pelon for mm. a little bit. My family still lives in Pelon. But my old dad and old earth moved there mm-hmm. and then um you know now i was a little bit too grimy for them i guess and so you, know, you were too grimy oh well, well now why i was not too grimy things. for like my old earth or whatever uh-huh. you know she used to just complain about it and mm. they seeked out sea law nation and then came to sea law nation and you were how old when you came to this? um i was about probably like knowledge equality Oh, you know, so okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I was in Nawa for a little bit, and then okay. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Yeah. So did you have knowledge by the time you got to? No, nah, I didn't get knowledge until I got to Sea Law Nation. Oh. So by the age of knowledge born, mm. then I started to you know hear about the gods, and they go back to Nawa. Mm. And um, you know, I went to school in Florida. I was living in Florida for about five, four or five years. Yeah, went to college. Went to um. Our institute, you know, for a lot of Dale. Um, we used to spend a lot of time in Miami, you know, build with some of the guards out there that I used to I used to kick it with all the time out there. Um, you know, Reality, um, Ty Kim, you know, um, there was there was a rap group out there called Field Niggas. Mm. Um, Mecca, you know, um, you know, was a good brother. Reached out to them brothers. They, Wait, you know, it was a brother named Mecca. Yeah, yeah, they had a rap group. They had, there was a few brothers out there that had knowledge, but you know, See, wasn't really on it like that. But at least they had knowledge, and we we out there in, in the desert, so yeah, with a name like Mecca, that's yeah, kinda, you know, that's, yeah. I know, I know, I know. But um, you know, he'd have to show and prove that. But um, mm-hmm. his name, his name was definitely Mecca. Um, but yeah, you know, um. You know, I, I traveled through through those lands and, and and build with you know some some of the brothers out there and made my way up to Nawa. And but you, you got know. knowledge, you got knowledge in 
CLR Nation. Nation. CLR Nation. Uh, and by, you know by way of who? Who was the one who gave um, The here? first brother that I heard with the signs was a brother by the name of Master King. Did he, did he give you the knowledge? Well, he kind of like... He sparked you? He sparked me. Okay. He, um... I met him like on um, Young and Dundas, right on downtown across from the Ink Center. Uh, this is like, this is around Born Knowledge. Mm -hmm. um, and he told me, you know, about a law school in Mecca. And, you know, he told me, he, you know, he was from Medina and he was out here because of Caravana, whatever the festivals, different things that's going on. And uh, he was just traveling the land as well and um and yeah we we exchanged math he's the one that kind of broke down certain lyrics to me mm. you know what i mean because i was like damn what does um you know uh what does brand nubians mean when they're saying knowledge divided by power equals wisdom but you know you got to start with knowledge first mm. you know because my man was grand pooper i used to i used to love grand pooper that was uh that was my man's and um, I just paid the lyrics. Yeah, yeah Grand Poop was was that dude for me. Um, and uh, and yeah, like he broke that down because that used to baffle my mind. I knew it had like a deeper meaning, mm. but I didn't really understand what it meant. And uh, you know, he was also a brand new Beans fan, and um, you know, he kind of looked like Lord Jamar to me. Mm. You know, he had a light skin brother, long dreads. Mm -hmm. You know, and um. His whole swag was like, now nah, why, you know? So, you know, you you could you you could spot him out easily in a crowd, you know. So, you know, I pulled him aside. You know, you you know, what you, what you deal with? He's like, yo, I'm a five percenter. Hmm. His name said him. His name was Cipher at the time. Mm -hmm. That was like, you know, a street name. And um, would have took a went a walk, walk. You know, we walked and talked, and and uh, he took me through mathematics, like knowledge one wisdom two this and that third and mm. told me yo you know you can make it to a lot of school you know that's that's the headquarters you know um you could build with some of the guards out there so mm -hmm. you know that's what i did you know what i mean i was already heading that route anyways because i was going to school you know in florida and whatnot um so it was nothing to go to now why you know so um you know i just went checked my family out there, built with um my cousin, you know, to this day we're real close. My man, my man Carl Ferguson, you know, mm -hmm. who does uh works for Hot 97, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? He does photography, he did, he's an in-house photography dude. Mm -hmm. And uh it was his man that put me on to the school, you know, his name was Takim. Mm -hmm. Takim Universal, understand C brother. And uh I met him. You know, my physicals, and um, we built, and he told me, you know, the next day, you're going to bring me to a law school, and I'm going to meet his educator, and his educator happened to be G. Colleen, mm -hmm. and that's how I met G. Colleen, mm -hmm. and uh, I started to get lessons. G. Colleen gave me, like, the 110, you know, told me to come back and, and you know, come to a class, and, you know, and then that became my... You know, my movements, like I would take it from the Bronx, take the train uptown, go to the class, meet Colleen, you know, build and add on like that, you know, and um, you know, throughout my travels now I'm building with guards in, in Pilon, you know what I mean? And um brothers will be sparking me on the train on my way, you know, uptown or whatever, on my way to, to the school. And uh, you know, I'm uh Melkorn scientist, one of the guards. Uh, I used to build with um, Asiatic, um, another Yellow Sea brother that used to be in Pilo. I don't know. I ain't seen. I'm friends with Mel Kwan online, but I ain't seen Asiatic in, in years, months, and days. Yeah, he's been around. He's around. He's still around. Yeah. yeah he's online also. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. You can find him. I'll put you on to him. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And um, and a few other guards. You know, Law Wise, Dark Kim. You know, um. These are brothers that, another brother named Universal, you know, these are brothers that I used to build with as a Yellow newborn. Yellow Universal. Yellow Sea Universal, yeah. With BBY. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Peace, peace. You know, right. um, so, you know, these these are brothers that I just, you know, I used to see in Pilon and, uh, you know, go, you know, it's frequent going to the school and 
and just building and adding on. Now, mind you, while I'm there, I'm still going back to Canada and then going back to Florida. So I'm going to Florida for my studies, going to Mecca to get my education, my knowledge, and then going back to Canada to, you know, build, spend time with my family mm-hmm. and whatnot. So it took me some time to accumulate all my lessons, mm-hmm. you know, in my travel. I, I didn't know I was going to 20 until about going power, mm-hmm. you know what I mean, 95. So from like, 92 95 like by by born wisdom i was really enrolled mm-hmm. you know what i'm saying in 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 lessons and getting them and accumulating them and building and, and you then, accumulating them like well from, from via through the law school law you school. know what i'm saying mm-hmm. so i figured if i'm getting them straight from the law school and who was giving them actually from law i was school? i was getting them well through talk kim and g Colleen. okay you know what i'm saying because that, that was just, that's at first mm-hmm. and then um then I was I was basically building with Prince, you know, because Prince was at the school, so I was getting lessons from Prince too. I was going to his classes, you know, getting his plus degrees, and you know, when you go plus when you degrees, huh? yeah yeah <laughs> get, right. going through um, plus degrees and whatnot. So um, yeah, you know, I keep my, my 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 lessons was I wouldn't say it was all over the place, mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying, but you know, in those times. You know, my, my I'm I'm all I'm all over the place as well. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? My educators and now why? Mm-hmm. I'm a, I'm not getting lessons till I'm going to school. Whenever I have breaks, I gotta you know I gotta go to them to accumulate. So you know I I lost touch at one point with Ty Kim. I couldn't get a hold of him. Mm-hmm. You know, so I would just strive and build directly with Colleen. Colleen would be dumb busy more times mm-hmm. at the school. So then I'll just build with Prince. You know, mm-hmm. so. You know, that was basically the science on that, mm-hmm. you know, um, how I got in tune with, um, with Born of Alaskan, which is my, you know, my educator, my black seed, who I consider not only my big brother, but my, my educator, meaning because he's one that actually educated me through 120, walked and talked with me through every lesson mm-hmm. and spent time with me. Um, mm-hmm. You no know, disrespect to any other brothers that I that I could also consider my like. Now a lot of, I learned a lot from Colleen. I learned a lot from Prince. You know what I'm saying? But them brothers, you already know they they so busy. You really got to save yourself when you when, when you with them. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? So you know what I mean. One of the last and basically took, took me time. under his wing. Mm-hmm. Took the time. Took me under his wing. Brought me to Medina, which you know the first time I ever even been to Medina because. More times I'm only in the Bronx, that's where my family is. I don't know nobody in Medina. I'm not going over there, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And uh, I remember he brought me to Shasha's home and started to meet now the Medina born, Sahim and and the boys, you know, and you know, you already know how that go, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> if Mega did this.